Welcome to the Approved Step in iChamps. If you're at the Approved Step, it means that your School Health Advisory Council, or SHAC, has selected an evidence-based program and drafted a recommendation letter for your Board of Trustees, or School Board. School Board approval is vital because it ensures that the program your SHAC selected follows district policy and it reassures school level staff that they have support of the district when they implement your selected program. So, it's time to present the SHAC recommendation to the school board. But do you know how this process works and the best way to do this to maximize success? That's what the approved step is all about. Your goal for the approved step is to get your program approved by your school board. This can take time and effort, but iChamps can assist you in making this a success. The iChamps school board approval process facts and tips will explain the general process by which districts obtain school board approval. Key to this is involving school board members and other important decision makers, such as the superintendent. Do this early. If school board members were not involved when your shack selected a program and created the recommendation letter, now is a good time to start engaging them. Have one-on-one -on -one meetings with board members before the board votes so that they can become familiar with the program. Ensure they understand the importance of sexual health education to your district, parents, and students. Remember to bring your facts. Let them know the teen birth rate in your district to show the magnitude of the problem. And let them know how long you've been working on this issue by presenting your SHAC resolution statement and recommendation letter. A formal presentation to your school board may be required. If it isn't, see if you can get on the agenda to do a presentation. It's a wonderful opportunity for you to assist the board members so that they can knowledgeably vote on the program. The iChamps Facts and Tips tells you how to get on the school board agenda, what to present during this meeting, general advice on presentations, and deciding who should present. It's unlikely that everyone in the district will be present when the school board votes on the program. Therefore, once it's approved, it's important to inform staff, especially school level staff. The iChamps notification letter to principals can be distributed after approval to ensure they know that the program can be used in their school. iChamps provides you with the resources to overcome challenges in getting key stakeholders to support your program. Visit the discussion boards to get guidance from experts and view the video testimonials from those who've successfully gained district approval for their programs. You can always visit the iChamps support step for more tips on engaging support from others. The approved step is a major iChamps milestone. District approval of your SHAC's recommended program moves you one step closer toward actual implementation. Once you've obtained approval, we'll see you again to discuss the iChamps prepare step.